Liberty Township grandmother makes her first court appearance today, accused of shooting her young granddaughter in the head. This five month old is now listed in grave condition at Cincinnati Children's Hospital. WLWT News Source Karen Johnson live for us in Liberty Township tonight where she talked with another family member about what happened this weekend. Karen. Yeah, hey, Sherry, I am told Mia Harris just snapped when police say she grabbed a gun, began firing through a bedroom door. Then they say she broke down that locked door before they say she went up to her almost six month old granddaughter and shot her in the head. We all love her. She's just a joy. A grandmother's heart shattered as her nearly six month old granddaughter fights to stay alive. She's in need of a lot of prayers and a lot of healing. The infant was rushed to the hospital early Saturday morning after investigators say she was shot by her other grandmother, 43 year old Mia Harris. My mama shot my, my niece. 911 calls paint a chaotic. Someone shot my baby, hurry please. And heart wrenching picture of what family members say happened inside this Dutchview court apartment. Who was it that shot them? It was her grandma. Harris is accused of intentionally shooting the baby in the head at close range. It's my understanding that she fired a weapon at three different individuals. Investigators with the Butler County Sheriff's Office say Harris first fired through the bedroom door multiple times, then broke down the locked door. She tried to shoot another family member in the head at close range, but missed court documents state and then shot the infant while laying on the bed. You know why your grandma did this? Because she was mad that she's going crazy. I don't know why. I don't. I can't answer those questions, but I can't change it. And I only can pray for my granddaughter. Who remains in grave condition. She's beautiful. She's an angel to my daughter from heaven. My, my, my daughter loves her with all her heart. And so does her daddy. And right now, Harris is charged with three counts of felonious assault, but that could change depending on what happens with the infant and also once the case goes to a grand jury. Today, a judge set Harris's bond at one and a half million dollars. Reporting live tonight in Liberty Township, Karen Johnson, WLWT News 5.